All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is uh, day 12 of the Nutrisystem diet, and this morning is breakfast time. I'm going to try the uh, turkey, ham, and cheese omelet, 90 calories, 13 grams of protein, and then, of course, my old faithful peanut butter. And then for uh, snack time, I got a peach and an egg, so pretty much keeping it all same, you know, except for a couple little things, and I got my, you know, nice big cup of water there just kick off my 64 ounces of water today um, so uh, let's get into this egg let's show you what the picture look like and you got all these little nice little you know how it's you know you got all the ham busting out of there and you got all this little stuff up here of course this is what you get I mean I see you know one one piece of uh, compared to all those little pieces. Maybe let me flip it, maybe it's on the other side. Mm, nope, is it on the inside? Mm, got some on the inside. Let's give this thing a taste. Now let me eat the peanut butter first so I can use the spoon. All right. Cut in there, see what it look like. Mm. Hold on, my mouth is full now. Mm. The peanut butter. Mm. Give me a second. Mm. Let's look at that and read the ingredients and stuff. Okay, I just stole the time while I get this peanut butter down my throat. <clears> hmm. <throat> get some water. That was a bad idea to do that <clears throat> while I'm trying to do a review. Okay, alright. Uh, well, uh, okay, let's get the egg tasted. Mmm. Tastes like onions in here. Is there onions in here? Let's see what's in here. Oh, smell. I had a little taste of onions. Ah! You know what I need to put on here? <laughs> Hold on. Let's go get it. My favorite. Yep. Hold on. Alright, here we go. There we go. That's what it's missing. That's what we're missing. We're missing our favorite friend. Yep. We need to put some of this on here. Mm -hmm. That's really going to pop it off. Mm -hmm. Get a lot of that on there. Now let's taste it. Now I'd have made this a long video than it should have been. Put some of this good Fiesta Pico de Gallo on there. Now let's taste it. Mm -hmm. Now look at it. Mm -hmm. Taste it now. Mmm. Not better. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. That's the egg. Mm-hmm. Mm. That's good. All right, we'll be back for snack uh, lunchtime, let you know what I got for lunch. But yeah, that's how you jazz that baby up. Mm. Let me show you what it looked like on the inside. Open that flip. Mm. Oh, look at that. Yeah. That look good. That don't taste good. Mm. It's not bad regular, though. It tastes like it had onions in it, but it didn't. So I added my own onions because I have, was already tasting it, but there you go. Thanks for watching my video. See you back at lunchtime. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back for lunch. And today I'm going to try the uh, for lunch this meatball parmesan melt. 
We got a lot of little melts up in there, a lot of little, you know, these little sandwiches. I guess they got meatballs in it, cheese, turkey, beef and turkey meatballs. And then I got a, uh, for my uh, smart card, uh, and we're going with the protein shake. Oh, no, with my smart card will be the uh, sweet potato. My uh, uh, power fuel will be the protein shake. I got a little protein shake here, potato. And then, so here's the uh, Parmesan uh, meatball sandwich, and then this is what it looks like. Mm, looks like the picture. Slightly like the picture. Let's take, let's take a taste here, real quick. Show you what the inside look like. I always bust these open. I think I microwave them too long. Bottom. It's pretty good. I think pretty much all these wraps are going to be good. Um, I haven't had a bad wrap yet. So, definitely going to recommend all these little wraps. Or melts or, or whatever you want to call them. Of course, my number one favorite is the Santa Fe wrap. Melt. So good. This is really good too. This is gonna be number two. I think hopefully we got a chicken wrap somewhere in there. I gotta look at my sheet and see what I got. So I definitely would recommend you getting this. This is really good. Where's my sweet potato? I got cinnamon on there. A bunch of cinnamon I throw on there. Okay, so it down. That's about it. So this is uh lunch. Uh there go the calories and proteins on that. I'll be back with the snack. Let you know what I'm gonna have for the snack. And uh, then we'll be back for dinner. And then we have another snack. So I'll see you three more times before we end wrap this day up. So and this is day 11. So appreciate you know, all the views and make sure you hit that like button and um, subscribe and share it. Thank you very much. See you in a little bit. Peace. All right, ladies and gentlemen, she got DJ Bishop and I'm back. It is snack time, um, and today I went with the uh, peanut butter cookie. We got I got a lot of cookies in my box for whatever reason. I don't know why. It's five grams of protein, 140 calories for this cookie. Uh, a lot of uh, cookies in my uh, pack. So let's see what it looked like. Oh wow, this looks good. Look at the picture. This looks good. Look how big that is. That's a big cookie. Took a bite of it. Hmm? <laughs> Looks can be deceiving. Actually, it's not, it's not too bad. It's not bad at all. You can tell something's in it. It always tastes a little different than it the look. But not bad. Not bad at all. It's actually pretty good. Def taste the peanut butter. Got some nuts in there. Nice form. It's good. It's not, if you compare it to a regular cookie, it's not as rich in flavor as it like if you get it from subway or from a cookie place it's not super rich in flavor it's like peanut butter taste and doughy i think this might have been made with that uh, whole wheat again because it has a weird taste to it but other than that i mean it's good i would recommend it i would eat it again so here we go with the peanut butter cooking future system. I will definitely be coming back again uh, for uh, dinner time. So be back at dinner. Peace. And we're back. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It is dinner time and it's Nutrisystem dinner time. I got the sweet and sour chicken. You can read that for yourself. And I got my vegetable drink right there. Also got my water, but this time I added a little extra to the water. 
I got that uh, great value strawberry and orange banana protein and fiber drink mix. And I got some stevia in there. You got some proteins, got some fiber in there. So, yep, I'm gonna drink that right now. Just, you know, spice it up a little bit. It's dinner time, you know, stir it up a little bit. So, let's get here to the sweet and sour chicken. It has a lot of spice smell to it. Look at them veggies. Veggies is going on right now. I don't know what this gonna taste like, but let me get the wrapping off here so I can see it. Got a lot of steam popping off. A lot of juice going on up in there. Smell of peppers. The peppers is just kind of popping off. I'm guessing this is chicken right here. And you got some rice and you got some peppers up in there. So let me get out a taste. Let me stir it up a little bit so you can see what's going on. That's the picture. Mm -hmm. Picture, boy, they, they, they really, they must have smushed it, smushed it together like that. They smush it. And they, Kind of get everything to look like that, and not, not really. Still can't get it to look like. Is pineapples in there? I do got some pineapples in here. So let me get a taste. Let's get a nice, big, healthy bite. Get some peppers and chicken in there. Get some of this red pepper up in there too. Get a big bite. Mm. Crumb. Seems like you need pepper. That's good though. Not bad. Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's okay. I can tolerate it. Get a healthy bite real quick. Zoom in on that. Chicken, you can't really taste the chicken. It really don't have a taste to it. I mean, it's, you could taste the texture, but it really don't have a taste. The peppers, let me taste these peppers and get a, get a bite over here with all this good stuff. Take some more time. Okay, the red peppers, you can really taste. The green peppers can't taste it. Pineapple. I haven't hit one yet, but yeah, it's kind of remind me of a uh, Panda Express, but it'd be, it's a lot tastier. <laughs> oh, look at this guy, he's just staring at me right here. Mm, you better stop staring at me. Oh my God, yeah, but uh, this is good. So I'll be back. Let me zoom in on there and give you one more peek of it. Yeah, this is good, I would recommend it. Not bad, it's not a bad, you know, it's tolerable. It's, it's not one to five, you know, I got to rate it one to five. I give it a good three and a half again. Three and a half, and that's average. It's not good, it's not bad. It's just, it's average. You can just eat it and don't worry about it. It's not something I'm gonna be like, ooh, ooh I wanna eat this every day, but I can eat it and not complain about it and say it's nasty. It's not like that three cheese, white cheese macaroni stuff, no. Nowhere near that taste. But it ain't on the level of that Santa Fe melt neither. <laughs> or any of those melts, to be honest. All those melts are pretty good. So, um, so I'm going to wrap it up. I'll be back with the uh, video for a snack. I'll probably either have a, another ice cream or I might go with like one of those. I got some kind of fudge brownie in there. I'm going to try that. It's in the freezer. So I'm going to try that. Matter of fact, I should take it out the freezer so it can thaw out a little bit. Yeah because that's probably what I'm gonna have. So I'm gonna take that out, let it thaw out of the freezer, and then I'm gonna have that for a snack. But um, that's it. So let me get up out of here. Let me take this down, to take this to the head, and finish this up, and then I'll see y'all snack time. Peace. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is the last meal of the day. And funny, um, my, my calorie count is 1,800 a day. I got after all of everything I ate today, I still got 448 calories left. <laughs> so I can actually eat something else, but I'm really not hungry. So hopefully this is not bad for my diet um, because I'm not getting, I'm, I don't get any, I don't get the full 1800 calories a day in. So um, yeah, so I don't know. But 
I'm having a snack chocolate cupcake. This is insane. <laughs> this is beautiful. I get to eat a cupcake, but it's not like a big hostess cupcake. You know, it's just a regular one. So it's 150 calories, six grams of fat, five grams of fiber, five grams of protein. So they got protein in this cupcake. And you wanna see what it looks like? Do you really wanna see what it looks like? Do you really wanna see? Woo, you don't wanna see that. <laughs> you don't wanna see what it looked like. Let's go see what it looked like. Boom. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. A gorgeous chocolate. And all is chocolate delight. Mm. I'm going to slide this out. It's small, though. <laughs> it's always small. Look at That's my hand. It's all, you know, it's always small. But I zoom in real close so you can think it's like huge. But it's really small. It's tiny. Yep, it's tiny. Let's taste it. Stop playing around. I know I'm teasing you guys with this. So if you want to get that, make sure you get that in your box, chocolate cupcake. It's probably going to taste good, but it's going to taste weird. It's not going to taste like I think it's going to taste because, you know, it's a, and this is a frozen, this is in my frozen section too. Look how small that is <laughs> in reality. This in the frozen section, I just put it in the fridge for a while, let it thaw out. Like right after I eat dinner, I put it in the fridge so it could thaw out. Let me taste it. Mmm, it's good. Mm hmm. I mean, who's not gonna like a chocolate cake with ice and onion? Come on. Come on, Nutrisystem. System. Are you really, are you sure this is healthy? This is healthy? I don't know. But I'm eat it. Mmm. That's good. I don't taste the protein. It tastes like a chocolate cupcake. A cold chocolate cupcake. Hmm. I love it. It's good. Very good. Look at that. Real good. Hmm. I don't know where the protein at, ladies and gentlemen, but this cupcake is delicious. So we'll try to see what's going on tomorrow, day 12. 12 days in, two days before Sunday to weigh in and see where I'm at on my weight. Also, I got a good workout in at the gym. I went to the gym three times this week. I'm gonna hit up again Sunday, so that'll make out of seven days, four times. And they say you do 30, 30, 30 minutes a day. I, I normally go to the gym for an hour, so if you break that up, I guess it's 30 minutes every day. But um, there you go. So I'll be back with more. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, share, and uh, make leave a comment or something. You know, see, let me know how you doing on your healthy, uh, your nutrient system diet, or if you're not dieting, just let me know what you think of this food. Cheer me on. Say way to go. Good luck. You know, something. Say something. I see a lot of y'all stopping by, checking the page out, but uh, you know, leave a comment or something, or just a like or something. Leave something. Just just don't slide through and and, and get off the page. You know, do something. Appreciate it though. I do appreciate everybody. Get up out of here. Peace.